Hi, in this video we'll go over navigating in the IT portal. We'll start with the left menu and then we'll also look at the search bar, these toolbar buttons, and this menu here. Okay, so we'll start in the left menu. Currently I'm looking at the global dashboard, which means if I go to devices, for example, and I look for firewalls, I see 14 of them. Because I'm at the global level, I see every company. So now I'm going to sort by company. Then I'm going to click handover company, handover management. And that'll open this company. It's going to change the left menu. Okay. So I'm going to open this company. And now I see the company name here. And that means that everything below it is now filtered based on this company. So going through the left menu here, the first thing is critical objects, which are defined at the, either the global level or the company level. Um, we have a particular video for that one um, that I will include in the description. Um, other sections here are viewpoints. Under viewpoints, you can see the synopsis, which is this. Um, you can also see sites, which are a subgrouping of a company. So a company consists of sites. Sites consist of multiple facilities. And cabinets can be assigned to facilities or sites. So we can look at the individual sites at a company. So in this case, handover management has four different locations. We can look at the domains and see objects assigned to those domains. We can look at the facilities. In this case, most of the facilities are at the corporate campus, multiple buildings, although you can change the facilities to different types, like say rooms or floors, um, cabinets, another grouping so I can look at this and I can see a rack cabinet with objects in it you can also look at IP networks if you are a password admin you can look at the password list you can also look at services so if you have a service enabled on a particular device uh, you can look it up here you can click DNS and you can see all the DNS uh, services running at handover management company Additionally, you can see contact groups if you have those configured, and you can see VMware hosts and VMs if you have an integration with VMware set up in the portal. Below here are the individual object types, and you can look at those like devices, for example, and you can use this search function to look for a particular string like so, and you can pull up an object fairly quickly like that. Okay, so we'll move on to the search bar. Here I can look for a handover, for example. By default, it's going to give me all types. Um, I can switch this if I want to look for a device in particular, like say that, that vertex we were just looking at. I could see it at all types, or I could do device and get that specific device I'm looking for. You can also toggle between quick and crawl search. Um, crawl search will, 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 uh, will provide more uh, more responses and it will, it will provide things such as um, information that you've stored in the notes so if you if you want to search for this phone number that's only stored in the notes if you could do that with the crawl search moving on to the toolbar here are the expired items so if I go to, to any of these like say agreements and I open one of these I will see that this is an expired um, item so I would want to modify this expiration date after reviewing this this uh, domain agreement. Here is critical objects. We have a link to this in the description uh, for a video that will explain that in further detail. Uh, links, these are like bookmarks in the portal where you can have a bookmark drop down. You can uh, toggle these and set them up under admin settings links here. Next, we have my portal, which are specific to you as a user. So your contact information, your particular settings, uh, your password list, your document list, and these are these are personal repositories not accessible by other users. Your display settings, and if you're assigned companies, your companies. And we also have the time tracker, admin settings if you're an admin, uh, reports, uh, training, which will link you to our knowledge base, um, hide and unhide the help, which will... Um, basically hide or unhide the uh, the help functions inside the portal and IT portal version 3.0 which will take you back to our older version of the interface and last the logout button which will log you out of the portal thank you